City, and I feel alone when you're with me. I look for places where I can't hide. Yeah. I guess I've been searching for places, some familiar faces. I think I just need a little light. I've been trying to fake it. I have said I can take it, but I think you should let me go. Cause I need some time. Since I got any sleep Yeah, it's been a while oh, oh, oh. Since I've gotten some time just for me Yeah, I need some time I think I just wanna feel like home But these days I just feel long gone And I don't know how to make it right I've been trying to fake it I have said I can take it But I think you should let me go Cause I need some time Can you say hi to the camera? Hi 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 It's been a while Oh Oh Since I've gotten some time just for me yeah, I need some time Some time 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 I need some time Cause I need some time Good morning friends, welcome to another video. Today is just gonna be a day in my life. For sure, I am going to go to Duncan and try the pink velvet macchiato because it looks so cute and I haven't been to Duncan in a while so it's a good excuse to go try it. So I just got ready for work. This is the fit. We're wearing this black and white striped turtleneck thing and then I've just got on some regular high-waisted pants and then I'm wearing my new favorite jacket fur thing from Old Navy. Oh, I love this. So it's just like really like oversized and fun just it feels like i'm wearing a blanket and then i'm gonna wear my knockoff white doc martens from tj maxx um the brand is sincerely jewels euphoria vibes so i am just about to head out for work so we're gonna go to duncan and then go to work and then I will update you guys as the day progresses. She likes chocolate covered strawberries and wine. She likes notes that say I love you all the time. Roses at your feet, baby girl be mine. Baby girl be mine. I showed it earlier in when I was like getting ready for the day, but I've been listening to The Hate You Give by Angie Thomas. Um, I'd watched the movie already, but if you haven't listened to The Hate You Give, you need to or read it. Like, it is so dang good. Like, Ready to order breakfast sandwiches for just $4. It's so good. I am almost finished with it. I'm anticipating to finish it today. Um, I would highly recommend it if you're looking for an audiobook. And I use Libby, so it connects with your library. If you have a library card at your public library, you can connect with it and basically like um get audiobooks in the app for like 14 days and listen to them through your library so it's really really a nice way to get audiobooks so you don't have to pay for them you guys like my phone case i'm really into butterflies lately all right let's go okay guys we got um our pink velvet macchiato i'm so excited but look how cute! Uh, there's a bunch of coffee at the top. That's good. I have like no clue what it is. Like what the flavor is. The espresso on the top. Woo! That's heckin' good. I'm so happy! 
Mmm. It's delicious. I also didn't eat lunch before I left, so. I've never had a sandwich there. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. It's a everything bagel, and I just got ham and cheese on it. And they wanted to put egg on it, but I'm not like a huge... Can we just, oh my gosh, if you could smell this right now. Oh, gee, it's so hot. I'm gonna try to keep it hot and eat it when I get to work because I don't like eating in the car. This is for Emily, if Emily's watching this. I'm going to put it on my seat and put my seat warmer on to keep it warm. There you go. Should I buckle it in? Strapped in, safe. I'm going to head to work now. All right, it's kind of crooked. Mm, it's not a good angle, is it? Hello guys, I am back from work and the store. So I just thought I'd show you, I went to Walmart after work and I thought I'd show you what I got. I only got three things, but I got this. If you have been on the internet the last few weeks, you would know what I'm doing. When I bought this feta chunk. So I'm going to be making the baked feta pasta. That everyone is losing their mind about on the internet. That's going to be for dinner tonight. And then I wanted to get some Valentine's candy. So I got these. Because they're really good. And they're shaped like hearts. And so I thought they could make like a really cute picture. I don't know what kind of picture I would take with these. But they're super cute. I could be like. That would be so cute. Mmm, these are good. We may run into issues with these. Then, I saw the box for the Reese's Pink Hearts. These are the best Reese's to exist, okay? And I saw the box for them, and it was empty. And I, like, looked all around the shelves, and I was like, oh. And, like, up on the top shelf, I see these three bags that have this on it like i could see the pink and the orange i was like oh what do you think those are reese's hearts two of them were like the reese's hearts that were chocolate in like the flat thing like they come in individual they don't come in individual packages they're like in a container and the top bag was reese's pink hearts okay so now that i'm home it is 309 i finished the hate you give um so good and i think tonight i really want to watch the movie i've already seen it but i'm just really in the mood to watch the movie since i just read the book it just gives you more of a visual and then i will update you guys later hello guys it's later james is now home from work and i have just been hit with this <sighs> wave of unmotivation and i don't know if I don't know what's up it's just like um dealing with i guess like living with depression sometimes you just get unmotivated <laughs> i did forget to take my meds today so that could be it so you it? no i just was wondering what this button did and i figured it out <laughs> I'm just feeling super unmotivated, um, and I don't really know what to do, so I think I probably need to drink some water, actually, so I'll probably get some water, and then, um, we're gonna watch the movie, The Hate You Give, I talked about earlier. Anyways, sorry I just seem off, like, honestly, if I wasn't vlogging, that would probably be good, but I started vlogging earlier when I felt fine, so, you know, this is just the reality of life, sometimes you just randomly don't feel good and you don't really know why so we're just gonna try to get out of that feeling um maybe do some self-care later like a face mask something who knows all right so what are we making tonight So tonight we are making some boiled olive oil with a side 
a feta. <laughs> what? We're making the famous TikTok pasta. Don't have the screen up. I don't like that. You want to see yourself? No, I don't want to see myself. But you look so good. All right, I'll just look at you. Yes, please. We're supposed to use like cherry tomatoes, which I ordered our groceries online. And they gave us these. And there's like not enough in there. So I think I'm gonna have to cut up some of our regular tomatoes, but like, it just won't be as pretty, but like it'll taste the same, right? Oh yeah. So we're gonna wash all of them first though. Um, so I will wash these quick and then be right back. I would really help, but I'm too busy recording you. Yeah, that's, I didn't ask you to help me. All right, so we've got the tomatoes in here with olive oil and salt, pepper, and oregano. And then the block of feta cheese. And now we're gonna start the noodles. So we're gonna use these, probably like half the box. Mm. Is it good? It's good. It looks delicious. I will put the recipe down below. If you're interested, it's super easy and doesn't take like any work at all. Hello guys, it is later. We finished the movie, we ate dinner, and it's now 10 p.m. And I've just been doing some like, you know, behind the scenes work, I guess. Um, like doing some Instagram engagement, making a TikTok, writing out my ideas, um, just stuff like that. I try to do a little bit of that every day just to kind of like help my channel grow and meet more people to connect with. Um, I want to start drawing more so I was kind of thinking of some more ideas maybe like selling stickers in the future so I'm thinking of some ideas uh, working on that kind of stuff and now I'm just hanging out um, kind of just browsing the internet a little bit just to kind of like wind down and then I'll probably go in bed and read some more of my book which I don't think I mentioned what exactly I was reading today but it's I Know Why the Caged Bird Sings. This one I was reading this morning, which I think I had some like B-roll of me reading. Um, that's about how far I am through the book and it's very good so far. It is intense. Um, there's a lot of like uh, trigger warning. Um, just the trigger warning for the book is there's, um, you know, rape and sexual assault. Um, and a lot of just mistreatment and abuse so so far it's very good it's very intriguing and i'm very excited to read the rest of it and kind of get more understanding of maya angelo and her background so that's what i'm gonna do i'm gonna go wash my face and kind of just unwind read my book for a little bit and go to bed so i'm gonna finish the vlog off here thank you guys so much for watching and coming along with my day if you have any requests let me know make sure you subscribe and i will see you guys next time bye